Hey guys, I hope you guys are all doing well. Um, I just wanted to make like a video. I guess it's gonna be like a a rainbow kind of eye type of look. So yeah, I'm gonna be using mostly well all the eyeshadow, and I guess I can use blush too. Will be from this palette, which is the Smashbox. That and just so you guys know what I have going on, I have my eyebrows are done. I have some um, just some argon oil under my eyes and I have mascara on. So I'll just zoom in to show you what I have going on. So there you go, I have my eyebrows done, my lashes are done. So that's all that I've done. So you can see my face is really red. So that's mainly my concern. So let's get started. Hopefully the lighting is good. I think it should be good. So I'm just going to pull my hair back and get it out of the way. I just got these little rubber band thingies or stretchy thingies. I don't know what they're called. I forgot. I think ribbon or something like that from Sephora. Like just today and I'm already loving it. It's very like. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is, I'm going to take, so I'm going to start with my eyeshadow. So I just got this also, the NARS. I'm just going to use this, and I'm just going to use my mirror because I can't see, so I'm using my mirror. So I just apply this on my lids. So this is supposed to be really good if you have like oily lids, which I do, fortunately. So I'm just going to put enough, take it all the way under my eyes. Okay, there you go. And I'm just going to smooth this out. So, the next thing is, I'm going to just take my palette here, and I'm going to be using this purple here, this one here, and this here. Okay. So, I'll show you through, like, throughout the video everything. It's a Sephora blending eye, and I'm going to start off with... The purplish, it's like a burgundy color, and mix it with the purple. And I'll show you what I'm gonna do. Okay. Sorry. So just keep going with the purple and the bronze color and just blend this on your, into your crease just make sure you blend everything so everything looks like it's well blended So again, just start applying this to like where I'm applying it. You want everything to be like really blended and look seamless. And at this point, I'm going to start patting the color onto my lid. And just start blending again. Now when you do like dark colors, you have to make sure you blend really well. Now again, I'm going to take that purple and apply it on the other side. I'm 
I'm gonna take this brush it's like a fluffier brush and then just take like a skin color eyeshadow and just blend like everything so you just apply it this is like your transitioning color and it just blends everything really nicely there you go she look like that then do the same thing on the other side That's how it should look right now. Now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take the pink that I showed you and apply it to my lid or whatever is left of it. Now I'm gonna take my elf brush and apply the pink and apply this on my lid so all the way in and this you do have to pat on. Can't really see it. This lighting is sucking. It falls. So I'm gonna apply a lot because I want it to be really intense. contour brush and I'm going to take uh, a mixture of some brown and the pink and do this all over my bottom lash line let's take more of the pink I mean the purple and connect them all together Zoom in a little bit more. Zoom in, fine. So those are the eyes. So I'm gonna go again with the pink and concentrate it only on that part right there. And bring this into the inner corner and then underneath just to, you know, give us something. There you go. MAC pencil. And apply this on my waterline and my upper lash line. I forgot how you call this. It really sucks, by the way. Okay, now I'm just gonna do my concealer, no, my eyeliner, and all that stuff. Okay, so that's the eyes. Now, I'm done with that. I'm going to take my black eyeliner again. And just smoke this out more. I'm gonna apply mascara underneath my eyes. Just 
There you go. Now I'm finally gonna start putting my concealer and all that stuff. Oh, I forgot something. Uh, whoopsie. On the other side, where it's not dirty, I'm going to apply like a clear, like a, I guess like a beige kind of color. A color like that. Just apply it on my brow. My found concealer, so I'm gonna use my MAC Prep Prep and Prime, which I always use. Then I apply my Bobbi Brown Corrector in Dark Peach. And please forgive my nails, they look horrible. Um, I was gonna do them, but then I decided to record. And this is the concealer I'm gonna use. Okay, so I'm just gonna do this and I'll be right back, guys. Before I do that, um, I have a foundation and concealer routine. So check that out. I'll put the link down below. This foundation that I've used before. It's a pretty good foundation. You really you do have to set it with um, powder and I'm in the color um, warm sand. So everything else is the same, just this foundation. I just saw it in my like it's like a nudish pink, which looks like this. and you guys know I love pink or you can use yeah, I got this as a sample today when I went to Sephora so I wanted to just show you guys it's like a really nice red so I'm actually going to use a red and just blend out any, any I'm sorry any um like chapstick that you have on and just apply this Kinda not really like a really dark red how it appears on the tube. So there you go guys. That is the final look. Hope you guys enjoy me and get a little close so you can see. Hey guys, so I hope you liked this tutorial. Um, hopefully it was easy enough. I don't think it was that hard. Let me just show you again so the eyes look. So maybe I'm try if I do tutorials again, I'm gonna try to do it early so that you know you can actually see what I'm doing. Please don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more videos. Bye.